Hey guys, what's up? Yeah. It's like four in the morning, and I'm doing a review on the Asian gay military replica MP5. Um, in my opinion, it's a really, really very nice gun. I mean, it's like it just feels so, you know, perfect. It's like perfect. And, but, down to the real stuff. Okay. The mag, we'll do the mag first. It is a heavy plastic. I'm not sure if it's ABS or not. It doesn't feel like it, but... I've had a couple of problems with the mag. I had to get a new one. But it's like the exact same thing. Because I called up, you know, that 30 day thing. So they gave me a brand new one for free. Yeah. Um, okay, let's talk about the stock. Okay, it's got three set positions. In. Out of there. Hey, one second. Let me turn my overhead lights. That's better. Yeah. Okay. This talk. It goes from in to there to. On to the sights. Um, I guess you could call them adjustable. You can turn a little thing. It's either big is for long range or small is for long range. You're not exactly sure. This is my first MP5. I usually get M16s and stuff, so. Uh, let's talk about the body now. The gearbox is fully metal. Um, um, the body, AVS plastic. This is a fake switch here. Oh, fake. <laughs> Here's a real switch. It has, as you can see, <laughs> whoa. Like, full auto. That's like the bunch of bullets in the line, you know. Um, semi-automatic. It's the single bullet. Full semi-automatic. Spring. That's spring. And safe. Um, this mag clip part, like the thing that holds a mag in, this little mechanism here. I had a couple problems with it. Okay. I was at my dad's house and, um, I guess I was messing around and I shot my little sister in the arm. And then I dropped it accidentally. And I guess the little screw fell out. And what happened was this started to pop off every time I pressed this button. So I had to put another screw in there to hold it on. It's pretty tough to find the right size screw, trust me. It's a pain in the ass, so. Um, as you can see the bottom of the, oh, yeah, as I said, the grip is ABS plastic. ABS plastic, it runs on, it can run either on a battery or six double A's. Orange tip here is glued on, it sucks. Um, I like the sights, they're really nice. Um, let's see here, the, oh, my favorite part about this gun, it's dual action, means you can have spring, or 
battery powered. I'm not quite sure what this thing is for. I think it's guarding the screw from getting taken out. I'm pretty sure it's not a clip for your sling. Because I thought that was in this one. But comment tell me because I, I can't figure it out. Um, part I don't like is, see the switch here? Plastic. Just plastic, you know? It's got, I guess, like, rails. Not rails, but like, I don't know what you call it. Um. Yeah, as I said, the mag has a couple problems. It's a really nice gun overall, I mean... I got it just to see what it was, you know, because as you know, I'm an avid airsoft person, so I put, I, yeah, I'm being into airsoft, I just wanted to get to see how it was, it's a pretty nice gun, I used it in the field two or three times, you know, fuck, okay, um, yeah, it's real nice, heavy AVS plastic, <gasps> oh yeah, the stock's metal, this pull not a stock. This part's metal. Um, uh, as I said, it's like five o'clock in the morning, so um, I didn't sleep at all. So fuck. Okay. Um. Yeah, this is a nice gun overall. I love it. Thank you very much for watching. Please rate, comment, 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 and subscribe.